but the flow is very important. Spice is the flow. Wait, the, no, the spice flows. The, the spice flows. Yes. Destiny. It's time is not a linear line. Actually, I think in this, I think time is somewhat linear in this. I don't really know what this game is about. Hi, I'm Tony. My pronouns are they them. And I'm Fiona. My pronouns are they she. Okay, so we're we're playing Shadow of Destiny today. Yes. Or Shadow of Memories. We are playing the PSP remake, which is a little funky. Okay. I tried to get the PC version running, which I did, but it was a little odd at times. It's the <laughs> PS2 version. Okay. I don't know. Anyways, I have no clue what this intro cutscene's about. I haven't seen it yet. I don't really know what this game's about. I just know it's weird. I, that's also all I know. All right, so we have some sort of uh, like fool, like a puck character is what I'm assuming. Okay. Like sitting on a door frame. Being like, well, being like creepy doll, like some creepy bloodborne doll with red eyes. Yeah, and I do not like the the emotionless woman trope of like, mm. like the doll or like the robot woman or yeah, firekeeper. Like, ah, uh, as much as I like those Souls games, not a, not a fan of those. Yeah, there's, I, I agree. I mean, there's a lot of very, uh, yeah. Uh, by the way, the reason why this it looks so extremely pixelated and why they chose to do extreme heavy film grain is because this is designed for a PSP display which I think is like I think it's like 3 something by 240 yeah uh, it's small I mean it looks resolution. good on a PSP but when you start blowing it up to 4 feet wide as we are currently looking at it doesn't look great so I guess we'll just get started get, get right into it I this is a time travel game so prologue the f uh, 4 8 2001. I assume that's the uh, day, month, year. Oh, well, that's sharp uh, in comparison. <laughs> yes, I we we are playing this on an original PSP, definitely. Yes, pay no attention to the four foot screen I hacked in. Well, well, actually, the uh, the <laughs> widescreen is you know, that's a PSP thing, so yeah, uh, the original was not widescreen. I have owned a PSP and a PSP Vita. You? I still own, actually. Yeah. I, yeah, man, my Vita died recently. Like, oh, that's too bad. Like the battery, the battery. I'm not sure if it's the battery died. I think the battery mm. died. I think that's a common problem with Gen One Vitas. Yeah. If if you just don't boot them like every few weeks, they might die. <laughs> Did you see that wind? <laughs> His head was like, whoa. Oh, it's a shadow. A shadow. <gasps> oh. Oh no. Stabbed in the back by a shadow. Someone wearing a white shirt with khaki, tan khaki pants. So, was he stabbed? Uh, there was a blood mark, I think. Without, I guess so. without being able to rewind. Also, those eyelashes. Those are intense eyelashes. They're, they were really fluttering, too. Mm -hmm. So, if you don't know, understand it yet, the, I will spoil the premise of this game for y'all. We have to find out who our killer is. Mm. It's it's uh, sort of a soul suspect sort of thing, but... Like, I think 12 or 13 years before Soul, Sp Soul Suspect. <laughs> Producer Koga. Wait, Koji Igarashi? Really? Who, what else did they produce? That's, uh. That's the, that's the Castlevania guy. Oh. Which I guess makes sense. It's a, ca it's a Konami game. Whoa, whoa. Am I in some sort of vague representation of death? <laughs> All death is is like a weird end table. <laughs> so we're, we'll, we'll listen for just a second here. Earth could have happened. Uh, am I dead? <laughs> <laughs> Bingo! Who's there? <laughs> Introduction of another important character, I'm sure. The puck character. How does it feel to be dead? Uh, I. That's enough. Who are you? So I believe this is we're in Germany. Hmm. I was gonna say it looked like Vienna. <laughs> yeah. I beg your pardon if I've offended you. You are strongly favored today. You see, you are destined to die. What? <laughs> Look at the eyelids. <laughs> you have the will to somehow reverse that lid by yourself. I can lend you some measures of strength. <laughs> How about it? Will you deal with me? Will you make a deal with a disembodied voice? Well, uh, thanks, but no thanks. Ah. Sounds too good to be true. That's a reasonable what? response. Right? Can't you trust me? Can't even see of you. Not. Look, I get it. You're the evil one, the devil. In exchange for your immortal soul and all that, am I right? 
That's a good guess. You're so, you're so, you're so <laughs> oh, please, it has no value. Well, Brutal. You do have an agenda. It's that you survive. Let me think it over a bit. Of course. Of course. Go ahead. Go ahead. But don't keep me waiting too long. How? I don't much want to be left hanging. Wait. What reason is there to procrastinate? Is that thinking it over? Was that long enough? I don't know. And now, or you prevent it. It's that simple. What have you got to do now, Look at his hair. Mm -hmm. All right. I'm sorry I called you the devil. No, no, no. You pegged <laughs> that. I die yet. Please, help me. All right. But I want you to be aware of something. You have to understand that the destiny that awaits you is a potent one. Which means that just because you manage to avoid death once doesn't mean you're free of the threat. Unless you tear out its very root. Destiny. This is gonna be like Final Destination. I, I, I think, I think kind of, and I actually like this idea of, like, you have to tear it out from the root. Like, you have to change, you have to change time so much. Like, you have to, you have to affect destiny in such a way that you destroy this like really potent destiny. That's kind, that's kind of neat. Have you watched Russian Doll yet? I have not. I've heard it's good. Oh my God. Yeah. Uh, this was originally called the Digipad in the original version. Hmm. In fact, uh, Ike makes it a habit to write down what he's been doing. If you got lost, or get lost, read your notes. You can select the scribbling block from the item window hmm. with triangle. Okay. Uh, I started watching Russian Doll based on like feedback from a friend of mine. I binge watched it all night. I went to bed at four in the morning. Holy shit! Yeah. <laughs> that good, huh? Yep. This will respond to the Damn, time. okay, all right. To you as, its user. as soon as it begins to respond, <laughs> it's usable, and you can select the Z-pad by pushing the triangle button. The Z-pad? Reminds me of the GameCube. <laughs> I mean, I mean, to be fair. <laughs> I mean, we're, do we're doing that thing where the characters are, like, in-universe in being like, use the X button to apply, <laughs> like... I liked it. I was playing a game at a... I don't remember which one, but it was, the character was like, what the fuck is the X button? <laughs> right, right, right. <laughs> it, it, it's, Metal Gear Solid is, in, are the ones that I think of the most mm. when the characters are like, Snake, you'll have to hold down X to engage in CQC. CQC. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Okay. Limited time. Got it. So, my understanding is that this game takes place in chapters, mm. and I need to make sure it has multiple endings, and I need to make sure that I've used. I think I've I've used the digipad by the end of uh, like before time mm. runs out of a certain chapter because it's. I'm pretty sure that you have like the real real time. Sure. Please wake up. And then you have the Are time you you're right? in. We'll, uh, we'll talk. Yeah. Do you feel sick or something? By the way, the animation that is in this game are a treat. I mean, considering this is originally a PS2 game, this... Oh my god. You see this what I mean? This isn't too bad. Sorry. No, I know, it, but it's, it's like, like they didn't go the motion capture route, and it's super early in the PS2. 2002, actually, I think is when mm. it was released. And so, motion capture was not a big thing by this point. It had been done. Yeah, I mean, but... it's not bad. Like, I'm looking at the animation. He's so tall. Right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, I fell asleep. That's a normal thing to do in a diner. Uh-huh. <laughs> Dana? Dana, that'll do. Wow, rude. <laughs> <gasps> All right, so we have Dana, I suppose. He's a character. Oh, how well, like kind of a little trot there. Yeah, I mean, this game was made in Japan. It was made in Japan, and it's one of those Japanese games that is about Germany, which is its own particular genre of Japanese games and media. I totally said this game reminded me of Valkyria Chronicles earlier, you, but and here did. we are, here like we the are. whole Vonzer thing. Like, I love me some Front Mission and like Armored Core, and I. Uh, <laughs> oh, absolutely. I'll just leave what I owe for the coffee here. <laughs> Ike, that's like five cents, Ike. 
Uh, they're Deutsch marks, aren't they worth like twenty dollars? <laughs> yeah, like that. <laughs> Damn, that was a huge tip. <laughs> That's kind of. I mean, I was getting a Vienna vibe. I don't know where it's actually taking place, but all right. So, town map selected from the item window, or oh. press the square button. Levin's bomb. I still can't believe what just happened. I had the weirdest dream. So I believe we're in the present time. But since I have this Z-pad here, I guess it really did happen. The voice acting was way goofier in the original release. So th this came out, this was oh, recorded, I think, in 2009. Did they redub it? They did. Oh. So check this shit. <laughs> I try to go back in the cafe. I guess this is as far as I go. <laughs> so <laughs> so remember that. Remember that line, because let's let's maybe go down the street. And what's that over there? A dog? A chicken. Maybe it's a dog. Oh, okay. Oh, that's a creepy I looking dog. I guess this is as far as I go. <laughs> <laughs> so that's how we're, they're keeping us in a specific spot? Oh. Yep. So that that's pretty much what I've got so far. So let's let's just kind of get our bearing a little Oven's bit. So bomb. we start at Cafe what? Anne? Cafe something, yeah. Yeah, whatever. Uh, right. Former alchemist house. Yeah, so we have like a west and east gate. We're in a big walled city. I, I suppose we have a south Brum gate. Museum? North gate's right there. Yeah, where where is that museum? Down yes, there. the broom. Yeah. It's probably broom, right? Broom. Because there's like an, a, a U umlaut sort of deal. Like hard, hard Except it's sound. not. Well, I know, but this is like a port of a g Japanese game about Germany that was never in its native German, you know, so... Like, it's, it's definitely broom, but, it, like, they, you know, I don't know. They're not going to put the umlaut there. Hmm. So. Photoshop, City Hall, Barzoom L. We have an alchemist house, the market, the, the Former marked Former alchemist plots. house. Yeah, look at that. Marked plots. Marked plots. Like, the Z is like a TS sound sort of thing. Um, yeah, so nice. I don't know. We, we have a lot of places that we can go I'd to right pick now. Pick a spot. Like, I guess it doesn't matter. Yeah. The alchemist I'd, house is close. Yeah, fuck it. Let's go to the alchemist house. Former. Uh, you I don't know if they're a former alchemist or it's a former house. I It's, it's <laughs> pretty unclear. Oh, there's a person. Wait. Yeah, so she'll tell us about the fortune teller. Hey, have you heard yet? Supposedly, there's a fortune teller not far from here. Oh, great. Everyone says she's always accurate. Oh, right. So I think the fortune teller is someone who we can go and ask for advice a bunch. Whoa. What do you want? Oh, those eyes. Nothing, lady. <laughs> nothing at like, all. Like, nothing at all. So we also... <laughs> oh. Fortune's told. Oh. Maybe this is the alchemist I house? I've never noticed this place before. Huh. Really? It looks like it's been there a while, dude. I... <laughs> I guess we're going to the fortune teller house. Oh, nice. I was kind of hoping to get that little green orb. Oh, man. There. That... Mm, I wish I could find candles that color. <laughs> That's a good color. <laughs> right? I would totally get a bunch of those. That, it's vibrant. That is a very saturated purple. Yeah. Like, I've made my own candles. Welcome. With your own, with your own fat? You. I've made candles from my own fat. It's super painful, Actually, but it's totally worth it. Not with my own fat. I use other people's fat. Right. Fortune. Well, I mean, that's the coward's way out. Yeah. Am well, I going yeah. to die soon? <laughs> I will do it for free. Thanks. I really need this. Please don't give me just the usual niceties. This is very serious for me. Do not worry. How does a person like this... This is not your average fortune teller. No. So, the writing is in... Is what? Whatever I foresee, you can change. If you take no action, the fate I see will befall I think we're going to get objectives from her, but maybe? I seem to see in you the strength to defy fate itself. The power to defy fate? If, for instance, and this is only an example, <laughs> you get out your Z pad and you press X. <laughs> taking a walk after you leave this place, and this would happen if you are alone at the fated hour. Oh, so at two thirty. If you know what awaits. You, okay, so we have to be with someone. To be so first, we have to avoid so our death. Not be by yourself, unprotected. But then what? If you are among others at the fated hour... Yes, thank you. ...the assassin must give up his quarry... ...until three o'clock. Hmm. But a single change will affect all else that follows it. 
Those are heavy bangs. No one I think it's just the mask, really. There are too many threads. Too I think that's like straight up half the face covered by bangs. I want some like upper arm covering red gloves though. Those are good. This yeah. is some super aesthetic from here right now. <laughs> Could bring even. Got some purple candles, got some like scarlet gloves. Okay, so we're gonna try to avoid our death, but I get the impression that our, it's gonna, death is gonna try to hit us way harder after yeah. that. Yeah. So maybe we can get in the cafe at 2.30? We could try the cafe. Well, I mean, there's lots of places we can be, right? We still have to look around, but the cafe has people. All right. If Soylent Green was people. I, I can trust you. Sorry, Soylent Green spoilers. <laughs> for a movie that came out in what 1974 uh you can time travel by selecting oh. the z-pad from the window and choosing the destination okay do i want to do that now well no because oh well i might because maybe i'm too close to 230 no we have 25 minutes like we got tons of time to find out stuff oh it's vibrating it is hmm yeah it's yeah, i think i think that implies that i can use it at this time oh if oh, I go okay. to the past, maybe I, the time in which I originally exist, 205. Oh, 130. So this is like rather minute, right? Like it's yeah. 133 and then 205. Did you hear that little fireball yeah. noise? Oh. Whoa! Whoa! Ah! Ah! <laughs> and we were eaten by a black hole. Wow, this is some 2001 bullshit. Now we're in the velvet room. Yeah, I guess so. Do, 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 oh, we're behind do, the dog. Do, do. Or no, dog is still facing us. Okay. Oh, let's go check out that dog. Oh, time is simultaneously tracking now. I guess this is as far as I go. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. What do you think about the low ponytail yeah. on our hero? Yeah, there's, I guess it's very German. I don't know. <laughs> I, I suppose so. Okay, so... <laughs> We seem to be in a different spot in the market in the marked plots. Hmm. I guess. And so up in the oh, top there's... right, the regular time that is passing is two oh six PM. So by the by two thirty, we need to find someone to be around. Let's talk to you. Excuse me. Have you seen a man walking around here? <laughs> nope, sorry. <laughs> uh, oh look, another dog. I wonder what will happen if I go talk to it. I guess this I guess is this as far, is as, as, far as I go. <laughs> this game seems to have tutorial walls in the form of like vicious dogs. Vicious dogs. <laughs> um, let's let's just talk to all the people around here okay. first, because yeah. I think everyone kind of vaguely gives you hints. Whoa. What? Looking for a date? Do me a favor. Go away. I look strange. Mind your own business. Hmm. Uh, I said nothing. Yeah. Oh, oh. look, there's a. <laughs> I like all these dogs so much. I love them. Uh, if I had it my way, I would take them all home and we would be friends. The hopster. Mm. I said good that way. That's the child. In fact, that I believe is West. Mm -hmm. Yep. Is this is this the hopster? No. Hey, what do you guys see? Hmm. You want me to come to the square at two thirty? What's going to happen in the square? A performer, maybe. Ah, so we oh. should look well, for entertainment. Right. I don't have anything else to do anyway. Okay. All right. So we got a we got a lady. Yeah. I mean, let's start. Let's um. What's this over here? The Kirkenster. Oh, there's a icon on the door. Oh, it's the it's a bar. Oh, it's closed. Oh, that makes sense. Well, it's you know one thirty six and also two oh nine. <laughs> So, so remember, people at home, the blue is our, the time that we are currently traveled to. Red is the present time. So that is that the... That's the lady we just talked to. No, this is, is someone else. Is it? Our town oh. is known for this giant tree. It has quite a history, you know. They say it was planted back around 1500. It's one of the town's great treasures. Oh, I'll bet some bullshit's gonna happen. The tree's not gonna be there. The people are gonna be like, oh, we're so depressed. If only we had some sort of public space that we could gather in. Mm. Oh, there's another doggo. Oh, by the way, the frame rate is shit in here. So in this <laughs> in this game, so I there's nothing I can really do about that on the PSP version. Oh, okay. I guess 
right bumper gives you a first person which is odd because okay when i'm in a building at least Uh, this is city hall what oh we're in a gift shop a little bird told me that the street performer won't show up today oh oh that's no good Mm -mm. there's an old map of the city in here i i want that great i might need that later right what a Maybe weird... from the other side of the desk. I don't know. May I help you? If you need a city map, please help yourself. By the way, if you want to look at the map, just press the square button. <laughs> <laughs> he got the old city map. So now, can I press a button or... Maybe triangle? Oh, we have postcard with a view of the city. Oh. Oh, I see. We're in that sort of game. Oh... Okay. Mm. Oh, an old map. Cool. Nice. The, oh, it's so much smaller. Yeah. Oh, this is so cool. <laughs> I oh, I'm already liking this weird ass game. Um, I guess that's. I guess that's it. That, yeah. That's is that so that's city hall. Okay. Well, I mean, who knows what those are? <sighs> they look like closed elevators or something. They might come into play later. Ella later. <laughs> Uh, we should look around to the east more. Okay. Oh, no, we can't. Can't seem to go way. east. Can't go northeast, but we Maybe can go west and northwest. Yeah. Because there's a doggo. Yeah, we, it'll, yeah, it's not blocked off over there. So we can kind of go up here right now. I think that's even confirmed by the all these buildings aren't mm -hmm. labeled. Uh, can you go in the cafe and see yourself sleeping? I... You don't. should do that thing. I don't know. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go find out. Let's go see if there's a cafe. I actually really like this town, so it looks cute. Like, I think it would be so fun to just oh, hang around great. in here. Oh. He can't decide. <sighs> Excuse me, sir. Have we met before? Uh, great. Of course not. And then... Yes. Mm. <laughs> That's it. I wonder what the green dots are. What? Don't talk to me if you got nothing to say. That's a weird ass character who we are going to revisit. There, there's us. <gasps> uh -huh. uh. Oh, what? We shouldn't have done that. Oh. You created a paradox. Oh shit. <laughs> Are you shitting me? Ah, uh, okay. Do not interact with our past self. Where's it gonna dump me? What? Did did we have a no way? Continue? Okay. I don't think I saved. Uh, you didn't, but I don't. Do we have? We do have to. Mm. Oh. oh all right. All right. We're going to get back to where we were. So if you enjoyed the video, please uh, hit the subscribe button. It was, uh, you know. it was a thing. Yeah. Check out the details of our Patreon in the video description of the end card. We appreciate the support and we'll see you later. We do. Thanks.